afternoon baseball here on the show. Today we've got a good matchup in store between the Seattle Mariners and the Chicago Cubs. It's Cubs baseball on the show next. You Darvish is on the mound for the Cubs in this one. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? You Darvish is what you look at when you're looking for an ace. Big, strong guy came over from Japan, 95 to 97 miles an hour, all the way back from Tommy John surgery. Has the curveball, the changeup, and the slider. Will throw any pitch at any count. One of the top pitchers in the game, the and you'll know Seattle. early if he's seeing a lot of swings and misses yeah. and strikeouts. It's going to be a long day for those guys swinging the bats. And he'll start the inning with a pitch that misses off the plate. It's ball one. First pitch, one o'clock. The 1-0. One -oh. Into center field, line drive, base hit. Batting second. And that'll bring in J.P. Crawford JP. as he takes a cold Come strike on. at the one knees. Strike. It's 0 and 1. Darvish has tossed more than a thousand innings at the big league level and hangs an ERA just a little over three and a half. No outs here. Oh, one pitch on its way. Turned on, but it's wide of first and foul. Long on at first, nobody out, and he struck him out. That was some nice execution on that pitch. Spotted it nicely down around the bottom of the zone. And when you do that, especially with two strikes, not a lot of guys are going to hurt you. You're going to get a lot of ground balls and swings and misses down there. Here's the third baseman now, third. Kyle Seeger. The As first the first pitch to him runs Kyle. a bit inside for ball Seager. one. First swings for him in this one with a runner still at first and one gone. The 1 0 home is looked at for the first strike. Yes. And it's one and two. So one let's ball. take a peek at our umpiring crew in this one. Behind the plate is Clyde Washington. You know, D. Rowe, he is a pitcher's best friend, Clyde Washington. Down in the strike zone, he'll definitely call that ball right at the knees. If he's consistent with it, Dan, which Clyde always is, I'm okay with it. Hey, grounder, right here. The one-two is a swing and a miss. That's strike three. That's a pretty good pitch right there. That fastball on the inner half of the plate. You can see that he just isn't able to get those arms extended and pretty ugly swing right there. That and cool. that'll bring in Tom Murphy. This is hit high in the oh. air out toward left center. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Schwarber will get there and he puts it away to retire the side. One left for Seattle. Now the Cubbies will get their first crack. No score. You say Kikuchi gets the ball for Seattle in this one. What do we need to know here, Danny? Hey, it just goes to show you how tough it is to pitch in today's game. This guy has a career ERA over five. At times he can be good, and at times he can be really, really bad. It'll be interesting to see which guy shows up in this one here today. Next for Seattle, Kyle Lewis. He'll get us started in the top of the second. First pitch of the at-bat. And he'll try to crowd him there to start the at-bat. It's 1-0. He's a veteran out on that mound. He understands he has to establish that inside fastball to open up the outer half of the plate. The 1-0. A swing and a miss. That's the first strike. And nobody out now. 
Fastball laid off well below the knees. The 2-1 home. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. And he got him. That was aggressive pitching in that at bat, and I like seeing that. He showed all hard stuff until the fifth and final pitch for the strikeout. When you work off your hard stuff, it really opens up your secondary pitches to be more deceptive. Here's cargo Carlos That's Gonzalez big. as Carter the first Rush pitch Gilbert. to him is in there for Carter. a cold strike one. Oh one count here's the pitch. Big swing and a miss at the fastball and he's behind in the count 0 and 2. Well, that misses says the home plate umpire down. one and two where it misses I'm not quite sure still a ball and two strikes you can definitely tell with that foul off right there that he's picking up spin on this pitcher's off speed nope. stuff no maybe expect a fastball on this next one neither guy willing to give in and the ad battle continue Lucky he got a piece right there. He was definitely late on that pitch after seeing a previous off-speed pitch. Now a swing and a ball foul tipped straight into the catcher's glove as he's able to hold on for the second out. Into the box now, Evan White. Fouled off. The first baseman, number 12. He'll work on keeping this top of the second one. alive. Here's the 0 1. Just got the corner that time with a fastball, strike two. Down 0 2 to a guy with this much weaponry, five pitches he can go to, not looking good. Lifted down the line and left. He was looking for a swing and a miss breaker right there, but left that one in the zone that got fouled off. Hit on the ground to third, and that is through into left field, a base hit. Well, there's a case, not that bad of a pitch, 0-2 D-roll, but something he'd like to get down and bury in the strike zone, no doubt about it. Yeah, ground ball with eyes right there. Nice job by the offensive player, just, just to battle. 0-2's a tough spot to be in, he battled. Malik Smith the next to hit as he will take strike one on the fastball Malik. here no balls and a strike hey I know the tying runs at first right here but if the pitcher on the mound executes keeps the ball in play I think good things are going to happen here we go guys come set and the 0 1 up, up, this is up. popped up Contreras it, shading to his it's right high. he makes the play and that'll end the inning so it's no runs on a hit no errors and a man left on now to the bottom of the second. The Cubs lead this one one to nothing. Hey, At the now. plate, you say Kikuchi. He'll Seattle. begin things here the against you, Darvish. Number 18. Here it comes. Ball one. One ball, no strike. He's ready. Here's the 1 0. Huh. And this one's on the inside corner, one and one. Pitch is popped up. Bryant has room in foul territory. One out. Digging in now. Shed Long. One for one after a single this first time up. Shed. And the pitch. Now the 0-2 pitch. Nope, that's off the plate. Well, that backdoor breaking ball just missed right there. It's a very effective pitch. If you can hit the outside corner of that pitch, it's unhittable. Oh. Chopped to third. Hey, let's get him right here. You got it. To oh. two balls and two strikes now. Wow, that was a close pitch on one and two. The count's now on two and two, but boy, that one very easily could have been called strike three. Really close pitch. And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full three and two. 
well the one two pitch didn't go his way and now a miss there on two and two you know he doesn't want this at bat to get away from him, so I think we're going to see a challenge pitch on a full count. He spoils another one and will do it again. Count is full. Here's the pitch. Oh, and he lets him off the hook there as this isn't even close for ball four. He's going to be pretty upset with himself about that 3-2 pitch. All you want to do in that count is make a competitive pitch, but that one wasn't even sniffing the zone, and he let him get away. So one gone in the inning here with the well, runner at first. The and that brings up the shortstop, J.P. Crawford. J.P. Crawford. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Ball one. Swing and a ball sliced foul into the seats down the left field line. One and two, the counts of the Mariners shortstop. Threw that fastball right by him. He had no chance to get the barrel to that one. Well, Good that's plate discipline to lay off the slider that time, and he draws even a two and two. Hey, they tried to tie him up on that last pitch, so I like that they went away with this one. The execution didn't work, but I like the idea behind it. Here now the two-two. He is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. So a runner at first with two away and into bat next the third baseman Kyle the third Seager. Baseman. Kyle Seager. From the belt kicks and deals. Hey. Seeger has had his trouble in these matchups facing right handed pitching that is he shows a lot more prowess against the southpaws lifted the other way down the left field line and this will wind up hey, a foul pitch. ball I'm right here got him swinging and that will end the inning Mariners leave one they're on the short end of a one to nothing score. So the bases are empty with one Batting man gone. gone. And the, the pitcher, pitcher bats next. That'll you. be you, Darvish. Darvish. Let's go now one time. Here's the first pitch to him. Swing and a ball hit out toward right center. On the move is Gonzalez. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. Stepping in and ready for Leading another shot. Middle. Tom Murphy no comes into that. this at bat 0 for oh. 1 in the ball game. Murphy. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. The oh. fastball here is he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. That's Two and oh now. Now here's the pitch. Too tight with That's that one. Three and oh. Great AB up into this point. A walk right here could really just infuse some confidence into this lineup. Right, fastball on. taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. Let's go. Ball. And it's up to He's a 3-2 right. full count now. Woo, not a spot you expect a curveball. He's lucky he missed because that's the kind of pitch that gets hit out of the ballpark. Here's a ball for Rizzo over at first. And he'll take it yeah. to the bag himself for the out. So striding in, Kyle Lewis, 0 for 1 Lewis, after he took a look one. at strike 3 in Kyle his first plate appearance. Lewis. Yeah, always frustrating to go down looking. Everybody does it, though. You'll have a few ABs where you get completely fooled. Look for him to be on the attack early in the setback. Swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line in right. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Striding into the box, Carlos Gonzalez looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Now here it comes. Oh, that's inside. Bases are empty here with two men out. 
can't get around quick enough and that'll move the count to one and one. And here's a pitch swung one, on and missed one and two now. Swing line drive that's going to be trouble. He's through first and hustling for second. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Wow, this is a perfect example of a Wiley veteran doing what needs to be done to deliver for his team. Yeah, and just watch this swing. Instead of trying to do too much with it and pull it, he stays inside the ball and is able to smack it to the opposite field for a double. Now back. And now Evan White as he looks at a fastball that's in there for strike one. A base hit in his first trip. This is on the ground over to first. Rizzo is there. And nothing will come of the two-out double as the inning is over. Danger averted following the two-out double. Don't touch that dial or the remote for that matter. More on the show right after this. So here now is the pitcher, Hugh Darvish, eighth batter of the inning two. now with the bases loaded and two Darvish. away. Yeah, good rip on it, huh? Hoping to limit the damage, here's the pitch. Fly ball out toward left center field. And this is down for extra bases, and with two outs, this might get them all home. It's cut off, so all three runners are in to score. As a manager, you have to give your starter every opportunity to work his way out of trouble, but I think they went with him maybe one batter too long. The bases loaded double blows this thing wide open, and the starter's probably on his last legs now. Here's Chris Bryant now, now runner in scoring position with two gone. This Ray. guy has been unbelievable. There were billboards outside Wrigley while he was still in AAA, and what does he do when he shows up? Rookie of the year, MVP. I mean, get in line. Throw in time for the third out, but it certainly took a while as the inning is finally over. Another good inning for the Cubs here, and you don't need me to tell you that these folks don't need much of a reason to have a good time. The three of us are back after this message and a word from our local stations. Digging in, Malik Smith. His last at bat Seattle. didn't go his way as he popped it. out in foul Malik. territory. Yeah, Matt, yeah. he's got to make an adjustment right here. His swing definitely broke down, dropped his back shoulder, and thus the result was a terrible pop-up foul. That's Fastball ball. just misses. That's ball one. One ball, hey, one strike. Nope. No That's offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Two balls, one strike. Ready to deal. Here's the 2-1. Two, one. Strike two. Hit in the air to straightaway center. Hap is right there, one down. Your D. Gordon complete. will move into the on-deck circle now to try to get something started here with one gone in the inning. Gordon. High in the air out to center field. And the pinch hitter will not be able to advance the cause, and there are two away now. So back to the top of the Seattle lineup, Up digging in, Seattle. Shed Long. It was a walk in his Shed. last trip. Long. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Oh. A high fastball is in there. Hey, let's go right that elevated fastball right there. That is the biggest change in the game today for Hi. me. When I first came up, a lot of guys working oh, at Greg Maddox east to west. Down. Swing and a chopper to third. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Mariners are down in order. They won't make a dent in a six to nothing deficit. D. 
digging in once again, J.P. Crawford. And Dan he and his fellow top of the order hitters haven't really offered much help for this lineup so far. No, your one, two, three guys are the ones you look to to generate a lot of action. And they just haven't been up to the task so far in this one. Still time for them to turn it around, though. We'll see if it happens. Here's the first pitch to him. Right. No ball. One strike. Here's Darvish on 0 and 2. Ground ball foul down the left side. Sent on the ground out to second. And this gets through into right, so he turns the 0 and 2 count into a leadoff base hit. Hey, they say in this game you better have a short memory. Well, that's obviously the case with this batter. He came into that third at bat after getting his ticket punched twice and was able to get a single. To the plate now, now Kyle Seeger. The third base. He'll hold off on the slider Kyle. to start the at bat. Seager. It's ball one. Hey, this is a perfect opportunity for them to get yeah, on the board right now. Up. Lead-off man has done his job, and now the middle of the order one gets one. their shot at the plate. Count even now at one and one. No runs, four hits, and one error in the ballgame for Seattle. That's a ball. And there's a fastball well off Two the plate balls, inside. A couple strikeouts early in the game, but he's done a much better job in this at bat, trying to get ahead and put himself at a good hitter's count. That's the ball. Oh, and not an easy pitch to lay off of, but he did somehow, and he's got it to three and one. Got to believe the pitcher's going to trust his defense right here. Look for something down in his zone to induce a ground ball double play. The three one. And that misses for ball four. And it's first and second now with nobody out. Well, they've struggled offensively in this one so far, but after that walk, they've got runners at first and second and look ready to make a little noise. Just need a big hit now. So here's the cleanup hitter, Tom the Murphy, over two, two with a fly ball and a oh. ground out on his line to this point. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And here's a called strike oh at the knees. Don't think he liked that one too much, but it's 0-1. First and second here with and nobody ball out. Two. Fastball oh. just misses. That's ball one. One ball, one strike. That's Way ball inside with that one, a pretty easy take two, there. Great chance right here as a hitter to be really aggressive. With two guys already on, pretty good shot. He's going to get a challenge pitch right here. That's going to even up the count at two and two. Darvish pauses and the pitch and this is swung on and missed and boy they took care of a key man there one away it's been a really rough day for this lineup there's really no other way to say it not a lot of good scoring opportunities and when they've had them like right now it's just been an uphill battle for them to make anything positive happen into the box now Kyle back. Lewis the as he up. will take a look at strike Kyle. one on a fastball Lewis. right down the pipe no hits to this point hey, roll up here now the 0 1 pitch oh. and he watches a called strike at the knees no balls and two strikes Sort of surprising to see a five-hole hitter take two in a row for strikes to start in a bat. Now he's way behind the count, so we'll see if he can battle back. A ball and two strikes now. A little low, it's two and two. So you'd love for him to offer at that one, but the execution was flawless. Nice curveball that starts in the zone. Great take by the batter. Oh, and it sailed right over his head at first. And now this ball's going to wind up out of play. And that'll compound matters even further. And don't forget, on a ball thrown out of play, the rule says that the runner gets the base he was running to, plus one more. So it's second and third following now the back. error. And right coming fielder. forward, the veteran Carlos. outfielder, Carlos Good Gonzalez. Dollars. He's ready. Here's the first offering. On the ground to the right side. And he'll step on first himself for the out. 
Now in the box, Evan White. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Evan White. He's set and the pitch. Come on, guys. Looking to minimize the damage here. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Mariners forced to settle for one. The five, six, and seven slots do up in the bottom of inning number six. The Cubs are on top, six to one. Now at the plate, Malik Smith. He flew out in his last at bat. And with his speed, he's one Malik. of those rare guys who you'd yeah. actually like to see keep the ball on the ground. You can't beat out a fly oh. ball in this game. High and tight here to begin the inning. It's ball one. Hey, push first, push first. Two and oh, oh now. That's the ball. Two and oh. Yeah. And that catches the outside corner. It's two and one. The problem for the batter now is he's gotten so inside conscious after those first two pitches, anything on the outer half of the plate's going to look a foot outside. Here now the 2-2. Grounder down the line at third, but a foul ball as it holds it 2-2. Two and two. He's got that certainly timed up now. I'd okay. be shocked if the pitcher goes to the well three times in a row with off speed. This one's flared toward left center. And that's in there. Base hit. Now we're going to have a conference at the home plate area, so it would appear that we'll see a double switch here. Your Brad Week please. will come on to pitch the now as he'll move into the eighth the spot in the lineup now on the double switch here. Jason Kipnis will also come on now as he'll now move into the second. pitcher's second. number nine Batting hold in the order here on that double switch. Jason. Austin Jason. Nola will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Austin Nola. Out save that's three full innings you don't see that very often these days it's awfully nice to have a guy in the back end of your bullpen that can pitch that kind of work seven to one the final today Chicago jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back you Darvish is the winning pitcher of record you say Kikuchi permitted six earned runs to come across in the losing effort. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. Here now is our final line score this afternoon. First for the victorious Chicago Cubs. Seven runs on ten hits. One error. They left ten men on base. For the Mariners, one run on six hits. One error. They left eight runners on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 57 minutes. Our paid, Our paid attendance at Wrigley Field this Wrigley afternoon, 41,649. As always, we thank you for your support of Chicago Cubs baseball and remind you to please drive home safely.